quite as sharp. They've run these cars right now just as hard as they can be run. So adhesion to the track is a little bit scary sometimes. There's Salazar in that yellow and green car going by. An experienced road racer, Eliseo Salazar, coming out of IMSA, driving for Dick Simon here. A very, very fine performance for him today. 40 years old, a very veteran driver, but a rookie here at Indianapolis. No one has ever come from two laps down to win the Indy 500. The youngest winner thus far in the history of the race was Troy Rutman. Now, Jack Villeneuve will be looking at a white flag and one final lap, a final two and a half miles. An unbelievable run. The story will be told that Jack Villeneuve went two laps down on a penalty and fought his way back to the front of the field across the south chute for the final time in front of Bobby Unzer. Going by us and he's looking really good, Paul. No problems. Ari Leyendijk staying right there, wants to get in that winner's picture. Jack Villeneuve on the back stretch. The magnitude of his achievement. Listen to the roar of the crowd. Back from two laps down. Only his second year. One more turn. The first Canadian on his way to winning the Indianapolis 500. Jack Villeneuve on the home stretch. And the 79th Indy 500 has been won by Jack Villeneuve. As Ari Leyendijk screams by on the outside. The young Canadian has taken the win. There's second place, Christian Fittipaldi. Third place is Bob Salazar finishes in fourth. Robbie Gordon comes across the line in fifth place. And look at the despair of Leslie Goodyear. The jump on the pace car cost Goodyear the 500. Let's go to Gary.